So this morning we will introduce the talk channel ECG machine from Kelwell. As you know, we have three talk channel ECG machines. Two of them they are very portable. So this is one of them. Uh, the model name is uh, ECG 1112M. It's a very portable top channel ECG machine. Okay. So when you receive the machine, you will see a very nice box with the Kelvin's logo. The machine is inside. The accessory box is inside. So let's take a detailed look. Unbox the machine like this. Okay. Here is the accessory box. Okay. We also have the main unit here. This machine is manufactured yesterday. I just got it from the warehouse. Okay. Take off the wrap. Uh, well protected. So uh, take off the wrap. We'll see the main unit. Okay. So uh, you can see um, the accessory box. When you open the accessory box, you will see the packing list. Check the packing list, see uh, if we got everything. This is a standard top channel ECG machine. So it contains the one roll of paper, paper roller, power cord, patient cable. Ground cable. Also, you have the electrodes, the limb clamps, okay, and also uh, six uh, suction electrodes. All right. Um, we also put the user manual here. It's a very comprehensive user manual. Uh, you can get more uh, details in the user manual. Okay. How to use the machine? About how to use the machine? Uh, you will see this uh, dust cover. This is very, very nice. If you don't want to use the machine after your daily work, you just put something like this. Okay. So also with the uh, uh, Kelvin's logo and uh, our website. Okay. All right. So. Let's talk about how to install the machine. You can see uh, we put a screwdriver in the machine. So you can use a screwdriver to open the battery compartment. It is a lithium battery in the machine, but it is not connected. So uh, when you receive the machine, please open the battery compartment you will see the rechargeable battery okay so you don't have to take it out I just want to show uh, here is the battery okay um, we have the connector here you just need to plug the uh, cable to this uh, connector okay something like this very simple. Well, let's put the cover back. Okay. Here is the handle. So the second step is going to be Connect the patient cable, different electrodes.
This is a 10 leads patient cable. Six uh, chest uh, suction electrodes and four pieces of uh, limb clamps. Okay, so you can see uh, we have 10 leads. Uh, from CE to C6, the chest leads. The quality is very good. You can see this is a banana head. Okay, it's compatible with both three millimeters and six, uh, and four millimeters uh, electrodes. So you do something like this. Okay, and you put it on patient's chest. You squeeze it like this. Mm -hmm. Okay, and. Uh, you also see uh, the limb clamps. Okay. Okay, you may see the limb clamps, the size, they are different. We have four. Two big ones, two smaller ones. So the large one is for for your uh, legs, okay. This one is for the arm, okay. But also it's very easy to connect. We can choose this is C one. Uh, we have to choose the right arm, okay. So plugged in like this okay simple and easy I just show you an example I'm not going to connect all the electrodes so here's the patient cable connector uh, when you receive the machine you will see we have a few uh, a few ports on the side if we want to connect the patient cable, here is the patient cable connected. Okay, like this. Screw in. Okay. All right. But also, you can see we have other com uh, all, all other com uh, connectors. Uh, OS two three two for data transmission. USB. You can save additional uh, patient information in the USB. And also the Ethernet port. Uh, you can use this to build a central net network station for multiple ECG machines. Okay, so that's the patient cable. Take it off. Let's load the paper together. Okay. Uh, here is the paper compartment. You have a button here, press this button, you can take off the comp compartment cover. Okay. Here is the, the Zuma paper. Okay, so put this stick in. Uh, people will always ask us, are we gonna install the load of the paper in a proper way? Uh, just make sure the grids they are facing to the print head. Okay. This is not the printer head, okay? This is not. So don't do something like this. Make sure the grids are facing to the demo printer head. And we have a very, very nice design. You can see the, the roller has a spring in the, in the middle. So it's very easy to load the paper, just like this, okay? So take a little bit out, get the cover, do 
something like this. That's how you loaded the paper. All right. So you have the connector to the power. Here is the power cord. On the back of the machine, you will see the power supply connected. Okay. Tightly connect the power cord. Choose the main power. All right. So you had to turn it on. Now it's off. Turn it on. So connect it to the AC power. You have another yellow button on the machine, on and off. Now the battery, the battery is charging and uh, the AC is connect is connected. So turn on the machine. All right. Uh, you can take this off or you can leave it on if you want to protect the screen. But uh, you know the screen is very durable. So usually I will take off the memory. Okay, so uh, wait for a few minutes. The machine is uh, booting up. All right. Okay, so uh, you can see the screen. It's a color display. Uh, the screen size is a seven inch. Okay. Uh, you can operate the machine by pressing the touch screen or you can use this operational menu. Okay, let's go to the walk mode and turn on the demo. Okay, and uh, exit. Alright, so this is the demo. Um, how you get a 12 channel ECG waveform? with the report. Connect the electrodes to the patient, load the paper, connect the AC power, adjust the filter setting and uh, the printing mode. Then press this button, this big button, run and stop. That's wrong, wrong report. Uh, this is a little bit of damage because we just got a, a new paper. Okay. Okay, so it's done. Tear it off. So you can get a 12 channel ECG report in a very, very nice format. This is the old 12 channel ECG waveforms. Uh, you can change the format from uh, 12 by 1 to 3 by 4 plus 1 reason or 3 times 4 plus 3 reasons. Um, the patient's information, measurement result, Minnesota code, average templates, and also the most important thing is the analysis result, the interpretation. Okay, so this is a brief introduction of uh, ECG 1112M. The entry level color display 12 channel ECG waveform from Kelwell. Um, if you have any questions, please contact your local representative. Thank you very much.